This is Ned Ned Nerb, the Schizophrenic. This is day 34 of 100 symptoms. I'm going to talk about waxy flexibility today. Waxy flexibility is a catatonic symptom. It's easy to demonstrate visually. So imagine I was in a catatonic stupor, which I talked about last video. So I'm So waxy flexibility is when the posture is adjustable by the doctor's hand usually and the state of a person is usually a dissociated or stupor state where they're not really conscious, not really interacting with the external world but their posture is rigid or fixed, not so rigid and, and, and locked because the waxy flexibility means that they can move the hand, they can move the posture, and the posture stays. And it happens when there's no consciousness. I'm talking right now, obviously, it's a different situation. It's They're not moving themselves like I'm moving myself, I'm just demonstrating. Uh, the other hand moving is a third party, a, a person outside the stuporous, um, waxy flexibility state. <laughs> and that's it. That's really the video. Um, I'm not sure why the brain and being does that. It's like there's stillness in the body but some sort of morphability outside. It's a strange situation. Catatonic schizophrenia is very severe and very desperate. It's a strange situation. Thanks for listening. This is Ned Ned Nerf, the Schizophrenic, with day 34 of 100 symptoms. Subscribe, comment below, share. Thanks. Bye.